I think that the real value of robotics comes where humans and robots are helping each other to achieve more than either of us could in isolation. GT Graffiti is a system that we've made to spray paint graffiti artwork. It's inspired by human painting motions. That's in contrast to, for example, an inkjet style printer. Right now, it's mounted on a steel frame, but really the core of it is these four winches um, that control these four cables, and these four cables connect to the spray paint can in the center. Then whenever the cables pull on the spray paint can, it'll move around. Our goal is to initially collect a small library of shapes, which can then be composed into artistic compositions after the fact. We capture human graffiti motions, so we had a human artist come in and we recorded them as they were painting. That way we can mimic human artist motions as well as possible. We want to be able to enable humans to do things that they could not do before, human painters. So one example is uh, a human painter can paint something on a small scale, and then our robot can paint it on the side of a building. That way, for example, if the human can't access uh, these areas, either because they're physically disabled or maybe they're in the wrong geographical location, um, then our robot should be able to help to get their message out to more people. Art encompasses some of the most nuanced motions that we can make as humans. For example, dancing ballet, or uh, painting with a brush, or spray painting. So the idea is that if we can reproduce these motions, then we should also be able to produce a lot of other human motions that are necessary for general automation.